They're gonna get so much hate. Oh, oh I know. I know, dude. So much <laughs> What's up, guys? Today we're getting a lot done. First thing we're doing is we're taking the old 350 out and we're just gonna put that in storage or whatever. Storage meaning over there. Uh, we got more cleaning to do and just more prep to do. So let's get to it. And if anybody wants a three small block, let us know. Yep, first, first sale for cheap, first fifty dollars takes it. No. First hundred fifty dollars takes it. Yeah, at least hundred fifty dollars. First fifteen hundred dollars takes it. Thirteen hundred dollars. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, so we got the old engine out of the El Camino. For you. Any of y'all that remember, this was the first engine we tried to put in there and we didn't, we didn't get it done at all. So we just took that one out. So we got both engines just chilling right here. Uh, we rolled the El Camino out of the shop so we can clean it. Because it has like a lot of nasty shit in it. A lot of nasty just the real crap. The only way to clean it is by taking this shit off. Because I don't look at my hands in it. Yeah. So fender wells are coming off. Are, we, are they going back on? Okay. Oh, the fender wells, no. Fender wells, yes. Yeah, fender wells, no. They're staying off. And uh, Zach, I'm pretty sure we're gonna need new motor mounts, bud. Those motor mounts are not looking good. Yeah, I mean they're cheap as hell, so. Yeah. So like a lot of this stuff is gonna be deleted. We're just we're deleting a lot of it. That can come out. AC can come out. Zach tried to take this out with a machete. That didn't work though. So. No. Yeah. We got the fenders off. It always looks pretty cool without the fenders on it. And so much, this is all this shit that came out of the fenders. But um, we also want to take the bumper off and whatever the hell this thing is. I think, I think we're gonna keep it like this. Yep. What we want to do is we want to weld bars going from somewhere in this area to about right here. And just probably, we'll probably clean it up a lot. Maybe paint it. Just to make yeah. it a little bit more stiffer than just this shit right here. More stiff. Yeah, stiff. Yeah. Um, yeah, so it's already kind of looking the whole rat rod look. They're gonna get so much hate. Oh, oh I know, I know, dude. So much. Hate. And like, I don't blame people for not liking this. Like, I, I completely understand. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's like Tyler Fiaco and his Miata. He thought it looked cool. He loved it. Not everyone likes it, obviously. So we're gonna get all the hate for it, guys. But um, I mean, honestly, we don't have the money to restore it, and like, we just this is what we can do with it. So that's what we're gonna do with it. So guys, funny side note, but I got the vice grip at just the right size that I can just slide it onto the nut and turn it like a regular socket. I think that's pretty funny. Fuck yes. <laughs> So nasty in there, ew. Look at this, Zach. This was in your AC vents. Imagine what we're gonna find on the inside when we're taking it out. Yeah, I know. That's heavy as shit. Let's put it in the back, come on. All right, so I had to go back to my house to take care of some stuff. And whenever I get back, this is how the El Camino is looking. <laughs> no fenders, no bumper, and no doors. Dude, honestly, like with welded in like chrome steel bars, it actually would look kind of cool. Yeah. Honestly. She got some thick hips, dude. Huh? She got some uh, fuck, thick hips. Thick hips yeah. right there, yeah. Like look at the front, you can just see how fucking thick that is. Yeah, dude. So, like, how much do those doors weigh? A minimum of 100 pounds. Not really? Really? 
Each no, door. I, yeah, I had yeah. to get help to fucking throw it in the back. Because if I would have done that by myself, that would have just been a pain in the ass. And they were fucking heavy. And they're at least four feet long of solid steel. Right, right. At least 100 pounds each. So just from that right there, that's 200 pounds. Those, like, this is only like, like the bare minimum. The fenders and the wheel bells, 50 pounds each. That's 100 pounds right there. So that's 300 pounds. The fucking hood. At least 100 pounds, maybe 50 pounds, so like 350, maybe 400 pounds. The bumper alone is at least 50 pounds, so that's altogether 400 pounds. So, the good news is, well, there's a lot of good news, but yeah. it's going to be so easy to get the engine in. The AC is gone. We took off like so much of the extra wiring we don't need. Yep. Like it's gonna, I, I know we're going to get so much hate for it, but you know yeah, what? Yeah, we're going to get it. so much fun. I was talking Fuck to it. our neighbor right there, and I was explaining to him. We're gonna get so much fucking hate for this, for just for this build, but he, he agreed with me, like, fuck it, it's my car. Yep. So, yep. why not? We're yep. gonna have fun with it. Hey, who's gonna hate, dude? Hey, someone told me, I forgot who it was, but someone told me, if you got haters, you're doing something right. Yeah. <laughs> A wise man once said. So, anyways, that's all we got for you guys today. Um, what, this is the third daily upload in a row? Yeah, third daily. There should be another one coming tomorrow. Yeah. So, anyways. I think um, tomorrow we're mainly like tomorrow one of us is gonna be inside trying to figure out how the fuck to take that whole dash and shit apart. Yeah. But it's probably gonna take two of us. I, I was trying to figure it out and I couldn't fucking figure it out. I'll have to look at the video. Up, but... As always, thank you guys oh, so much dude. for watching. Uh, I guess we're not done yet. This right here, the whole entire kit, $18.99. For what? Up at Amazon. For brakes? Brand new set. That's good. Yeah. All right. Cool. All so, right. Yeah. yeah. You done? Okay. And we'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace. <laughs> Oh, Alright Zach. That's funny as fuck you called it. <laughs> I was just laying on the bike and he was like, Zach, that's it's a little fun. Isn't it? it is. <laughs> so we're at our local car meet and like this I see the him. Fucking time. Yes. I see this him riding. And then that <laughs> I'm like, Zach, is that your old LaFon? And this is the old bike. So what all have awesome. you done to it? Uh, just that manifold, uh, clean the carburetor out, I mean starter. So there's no more sketchy ass like screwdriver on the nope, solenoids. It, I just connected my old speaker wire into the solenoid. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. I have this. I see you got the new clutch lever on there. Well, I broke it off. I don't want that to look on Oh, oh, okay. Well, it looks new. And like, what's the top speed on it now? I can get up to 50 on Whitley all the time just to go to Bear Creek Park. Dude, that's awesome. So do you, like, you go on like 35 or anything? I'm going on 35. <laughs> uh, I've been on uh, North Tarrant and I've been on fucking Kroger, Kroger Drive. I don't go on, I, I tried not to get on this street right here. Yeah, yeah, dude, that's awesome.